Hello everyone. Hope you are all fit and fine and doing very well. This video is going to be a very interesting one. Though it is not any course or syllabus oriented but obviously maths related and very much informative. So let's start. Suppose you are in front of a tall structure. Let it be the Kutub Minar in New Delhi. Do you know it is possible to measure the height of the Kutub Minar just by a simple device made by you? Yes, in this video I will show you how to make a clinometer. A clinometer is a simple device by which you can easily evaluate the height of any tall structures such as Kutub Minar in New Delhi, Burj Khalifa in Saudi Arabia, any tall trees, high rise buildings etc. Now, Let's see how to make a clinometer. Take a plastic protractor. This is the plastic protractor. Drill a small hole at its center of the baseline of the protractor. Now take a string of about 8 to 10 inches long. Tie one end of the string through the hole in the protractor. On the other end, a light object is tied so that when it is suspended at the end of the string, it has a tension. Attach a plastic straw with the straight edge of the protractor using two pieces of sellotape. It is very important that the string is at 90 degree mark and is perpendicular to the straight edge of the protractor. This instrument is called clinometer. To use this clinometer, one should look through the straw at the top of the object and in this position, he should look at where the string crosses the protractor and read the angle. Now this is the most important and interesting part of this video. In this part, I will show you the calculation of the height of Burj Khalifa with the help of this simple instrument known as clinometer. Suppose a person stands in front of Burj Khalifa and he is 100 meter away from the magnificent skyscraper okay, with a clinometer in his hand. Now when he looks through the straw of the clinometer and sees the top of the Burj Khalifa then let the string of the clinometer get shifted from 90 degree mark to 7 degree mark. Okay. So, since the initial position of the string was at 90 degree and when he sees through the straw at the top of the Burj Khalifa, then the string gets shifted from 90 degree mark to 7 degree mark. So, the angle of inclination of the top of Burj Khalifa is 90 minus 7 degree that is 83 degree with the help of this 83 degree we can easily find out with the help of this angle of inclination which is 83 degree we can easily find out the height of Burj Khalifa so you have obtained the angle of inclination of the top of the tower with the help of this simple instrument known as clinometer look at the diagram AM is the height of the tower, CN is the height of the person who is observing the top of the tower at an angle 83 degree. Now you know in right angle triangle ABC tan theta is equal to perpendicular by base, tan theta is equal to perpendicular is AB and base is BC. Now tan theta in place of theta put 83 degree because you have found out the angle of inclination with the help of this instrument. So in place of theta put 83 degree, AB remains same and in place of BC put 100 because BC is the distance between the person and the uh, Wurj Khalifa which is 100 meter. Now cross multiply it, tan 83 value of tan 83 is 8.14 is equal to AB by 100 cross multiply it you will get 814 meter but 814 meter is not the height of the tower. AB 
is this portion ab is the portion of the tower total tower is am not ab and bm is how much bm is equal to cn that is the height of the person is cn cn is equal to bm bm because it is a rectangle that's why opposite sides are equal that's why this value and this value are same so you will obtain the height of the tower by adding the height of the person with ab 814 meter is the length of ab and the length of bm is 1.5 meter which is 815.5 meter but the actual height of the tower is 828 meter so some error has occurred 828 minus 815.5 that is 13.5 meter error has occurred okay and this error is due to the fractional degree of angle of inclination which cannot be measured uh, with the help of this uh, simple instrument known as clinometer this this clinometer okay so actually we we have not taken into consideration that fractional degree of angle of inclination uh, or it is not taken into account that's why this error has occurred so 815.5 meter is approximate length or height of Burj Khalifa hope you will like this video please like share and subscribe to my channel thank you very much and bye bye